Jerry Rose for the Thomas McCune and NOLA.com here with Neville coach Mickey McCarty. Tigers back in the Superdome for the fourth time in six years. How's it feel to be back? Does it feel like home? Well, it feels great to be back. We've got a, uh, obviously a new team, a new, uh, you know, each team has its own DNA, and uh, we're proud of this team to claw their way back, uh, to get back to the Superdome. And uh, real excited to uh, be here and excited for a great matchup. Folks will remember those teams that, that split with uh, with Carr a couple years ago. Um, you mentioned the DNA of this team. What what has really stood out and kind of characterized this team more than anything? I think we've continued to improve, Jarrett, throughout the year. Uh, I thought last week we played our most complete game of the year, which was great to see. Um, we've got a good group of kids that have worked hard for us. They've uh, persevered through some uh, through different things this year uh, as a team and as a community, actually. But uh, it's uh, it's been a good group. We're proud of them. And, uh, you know, obviously every team here would like to cap it off with the championship. And uh, we understand to do that we have to play extremely well on tomorrow. Y'all have a lot of playoff history in recent years against Easton's district rivals, yeah. but this is the first time y'all will see Easton. Just thoughts on, on how they've looked as you prepare and look at film and whatnot? Well, you could see this team coming, I thought, in Easton the last couple of years. Uh, you know, we've seen them on film against Carr uh, the last two times we were down here to play. Uh, again, this year, uh, preparing for Carr, but uh, they're a very talented football team. They're well coached, obviously. Uh, their team has a lot of excitement, uh, you know, to be here, and they have exciting playmakers, uh, as does our team have. And, um, you know, the, the biggest thing I can say about them is they deserve to be here, uh, just like our team does. I think it's two, uh, two good ones. And we've said all along that whoever wins a 4A championship will have earned that trophy. And uh, I think that will be the case, uh, whoever can hoist it tomorrow. Um, you mentioned the playmakers, uh, their side. They've got the quarterback who apparently has 47 touchdowns with one interception because just utilizing those playmakers and short passing game and whatnot. What do you all have to do to try and con contain some of those type of things that they pose yeah it's uh it's kind of a try to slow them down uh, idea they're uh, phenomenal numbers they put up phenomenal talent on that side of the football phenomenal speed um you know we will we'll have a lot of trouble if we just have to have to run with them they're um uh, they're they're very talented athletically uh and they're well coached in their schemes but you know hopefully we can do some things to uh, to slow them down a little bit and, and then offensively we have to do a good job keeping the football um uh, you know take advantage of opportunities the offense has because uh, our defense certainly has its hands full as our offense does they're very you know they're a good solid football team so um but it'll be interesting to see how we hold up against all that speed and talent Coach McCarty from Neville, Jerry Rose with the Times Picking and Nola.com.